So we're back on the barn build. So it's pretty cold here and we're really uh, trying to do our best to not waste too much gas. So I got the thermostat pretty low to be honest, so I'm still wearing pretty warm clothes in here. But one thing that's some pretty cool, pretty cool data is uh, you know around this hole here we've got 27 degrees F there and then it's 52 on the wall. So that's just a bunch of cold air coming in. So as you shine this around, let's As you sign that around, you can see, oh, there's some cold and there's some super cold. So, uh, you know, that hole in the wall there is, you can't really see on there, but yeah, there's 26 degrees F in there. So this thing's actually super cool. So you can see we're all anywhere where it's blue, purple, that's some really cold, cold air. So this gives you a pretty good example of where all your cold air is coming in. So uh, yeah, that's around the door frame. We've got a bit of cleaning to do in here today, but just uh, not gonna waste too much of your time with that. But yeah, just if you look at that, you can see all along the bottom there, there's all this cold air coming in. So, uh, So we're going to uh, seal that up and then get this roof done and then that should be us insulated and on to the next project. So I'll uh, yeah, get this insulation done. So we've uh, got this shop clean and emptied. We've got all the heaters on. We've got the uh, little heater, the big heater. The big heater is heating up our foam. So this bad boy is meant to be it. 24C. So it's been sitting in front of that heater for about an hour now, so uh, we're going to call that good. The uh, temperature is probably too cold for what we actually want to achieve, but winter's pretty much here, so we're making it happen. Got my trusty pilot, he's going to uh, be in control. And yeah, we're going to drive around this little forklift and get some uh, insulation on this roof. See how it goes. Let's do that pretend first cold start up. Cold start check. Oh, stop Fire it. Right <laughs> So, I, uh, you probably can't see super well, but I've got it everywhere on me. It make, actually makes a pretty good mess, so we're going to grab the hat. It's been worn a lot, so she's sacrificial. Some gloves, and uh, you can see I've just made a mess everywhere. Everywhere we've been debating there's a mess. So, uh, pretty glad I got the spam suit on. I did kind of ruin a lot of my... Uh, stuff here so we'll be the cleaning to do so we'll move that out of the way for now but uh yeah let's get into it we did get this done this, this, uh, this is our finished product as you've seen in that time lapse it's come up sweet we're just going to hit it now we're going to go for uh the full thickness now so we're going to load it up see how it goes so we uh as you can see we've got a couple of square feet done not a lot but uh, these kits come with uh, some nozzles. We've got the two different types of nozzles here. We've got the uh, blue nozzle and the clear nozzle and Corey the nozzle. And the blue nozzles spray a nice wide spray and the clear nozzles are quite a fine spray. So we used all our blue nozzles and these uh, clear nozzles, they don't really spray very, it's a super, and it's probably like three inches wide, two to three inches. So they weren't spraying that great. And the bottles, it's quite cold in here. Well, it's not super cold, but the bottles actually got cold and it says we should keep them at 24 degrees C. So that got too cold as well. So we put the bottles in front of the heater, went down to Home Depot and uh, got some more nozzles that came with a sweet $500 lot of foam. 
So we are going to need more foam, so it's not really a waste, but uh, yeah, we've got more nozzles, we can keep working. Alright, so we had a pretty decent day yesterday. Um, we got a fair bit of insulation done as you can see back there. We did use uh, way more than I anticipated, but uh, hey, that's part of it. So this is what we thought we might have needed. This is what we grabbed because we, uh, we uh, needed some more nozzles, so we bought this. So, and we probably need another two of those big ones to finish off over there. But, but one pretty cool thing is uh, we're definitely trying to keep that place as warm as we can and pretty much save as much gas as we can. You can see on the roof, I'm not sure if you'll be able to see on the camera. Yeah, you can kind of see, so the right hand side here is more melted than the left hand side where we got the insulation so uh that's kind of cool that means it's definitely working so that's a bonus so we will order a couple more get the rest of that done next weekend hopefully we can get that in and get that done and then uh that's that part of it finish onto the uh floors so we're gonna round out that video there i'm gonna get the rest of that done off camera because uh i mean it's pretty boring and then uh onto the floors so we can come up with.